All right, so I had this uh, really good question from Justin, who is a website member at samgoldengolf.com, and he was just asking um, a little bit about his, the technique in his swing. He sent me some videos, and we could see that on his downswing, his right arm kind of got away from his body, and then coming through impact, it was kind of flipping, coming a little bit too steep from the outside, and then hands kind of releasing and flipping, coming through impact. So I just wanted to show you guys a drill. This is you know, it's kind of commonly called a casting move or an early, early release or an armsy or handsy swing, but I want to give you a drill that'll help you really understand just the sensation that we want to have and then a, a way to really groove that sensation in so that you can take it to your full swing. So the drill is pretty simple. We're just going to put the club down, you know, sole the club right behind the ball, right in the center of the club face. And then we're going to take our grip, but we're going to try to get our right elbow to touch our right hip bone. So from there, we're just going to get the sensation that our right elbow is on our right hip bone and try to get comfortable, find yourself in a position that you can set up to the ball there. And then we're just going to feel that we make a turn back with our body, but our elbow doesn't leave our right hip. So this is going to be a really short swing, but we'll just kind of find that right hip bone, turn back to here, and we're going to keep the club face relatively square to the arc. We're not going to hinge our wrists, roll our hands, or lift our arms. We're just going to set. Get that right elbow as close to that right hip bone as possible. We'll do a practice swing first. And we're just going to turn back and turn through and try to keep that right elbow as close to that right hip bone as possible. And then we're going to just go up and set up to the ball and try one. So what you'll see on that swing is that my right arm and right elbow stayed really close to my body. And we're just trying to produce that sensation. We're trying to get consistently in that position where our arms and our body are connected through the shot. We're not casting. We're not early releasing and standing up and flipping and all those uh, undesirable things. So try that drill. I'm doing this with a nine iron. Um, I think it's a, a perfect club for this drill. Again, you're just going to set the club down, try to get connected with your right side, make a couple rehearsals where you can keep that elbow connected Again, we're not doing wrist hinging or rotating the face or anything, just turning back and turning through, and then we'll come up to the ball, try to get that same sensation. What you should see from that is a little bit of a push with a little bit of a draw. And if it's not drawing, it's probably because your club face is open, because this right elbow, right hip will absolutely get you on an in to out path. So if it's pushing and it's not drawing, just be aware that your club face is probably opening on the backswing. So we'll just keep that a little bit more square to the path, and that'll get your ball started out a little bit to the right and curving back to the left.